Hello YouTube! Welcome to another fun video featuring this here air gun. I got this from Air Gun Depot um, here in Utah. I picked it up at the warehouse. For more information on this specific model, this is the Talon P Carbine. You can find out more info at the link below. Uh, air Gun Depot does some really cool videos on like anything from how-tos to reviews and I use a lot of them myself when I'm setting up these new air guns, so definitely check that out. If you did see my last air gun video, then you recognize this Talon P carbine. Remember, it has a suppressor, silencer, whatever you wanna call it. Twist on, twist off, as easy as that. It is a single shot, boom, boom, boom. <laughs> and the last time that I took this outside, I had 2,000 PSI, 3,000 PSI is full, and I went out and shot it for what felt like a lot and came back in and it still had 1,000 PSI. So it got me thinking, I have this common misconception that air guns run out of air fast, but I've noticed I've been pleasantly surprised every single time with how long the air actually lasts. So it got me thinking, there's a thousand PSI on there. I need to take this out, shoot it literally from a thousand down to zero. See how many times I get to shoot it with just a thousand PSI? Then I know when it's full, it's gonna be that times three, right? Because I feel like my misconception, a lot of other people probably have. Oh, it runs out of air fast or, you know, you know, it takes a long time to reload or put air back in or whatever. And the next video, which is probably gonna go live next week is the Flash Pup. Um, that's actually right. Yeah. Oh, it's a little heavy for one hand. Hold on. So the video featuring this sweet air gun from Air Gun Depot is going to go live next week. So definitely stay tuned for that. I'm going to have a video on this and then I'm going to have a video on the Benjamin Fortitude 22 cal. Ooh. <laughs> But then after that, we're gonna do like fill up methods. We're gonna do a side by side like foot pump versus the air pump, like the compressed air on filling the air guns up. Both of them are really easy. There's pros and cons to different methods, but I think that's gonna be a really helpful video for everyone and helpful for me to compare side by side as well. So like I've told you guys a million times, I'm totally new to the air gun scene. So we kind of learn together through each video. I feel really comfortable with the Talon P Carbine. It's probably the air gun I've shot the most. Probably the easiest to use, really safe, really versatile. You can hunt with it. You can use it for just target practice. It's great for kids, so on. Okay, so we're gonna take this outside, literally count how many rounds we get out of a thousand PSI. We'll multiply that by three and then we won't be wondering anymore. Or at least I won't be wondering because I'm really curious. Remember that the cool thing about this here air gun is that you can adjust the power that you're shooting at. If you're hunting, you can crank that baby up to 10 or eight or nine or whatever and really pack a punch with your target. This shoots 25 cal. I actually have some in my pocket, let me show you. This is what it looks like. My camera is gonna have a hard time focusing with everything that's going on. But this is what it looks like. So we're gonna figure that out together. It is the most beautiful day ever, so I'm so excited to get outside. Literally tank top weather. I could be wearing shorts if I wanted to. It's so beautiful. Okay, 1,000 PSI on the dot. You see that? Let's see how many we can shoot. Five. So to load it, you guys, simply push that forward, take this 25 cal here, put it in, pull it back, literally just as easy as that. Safety forward means fire. 
and release. What was that, six? I'm gonna lose count real fast. It's like hardly like using any air. A really cool feature about this here air gun that I figured out just recently is that when you fire, the safety automatically goes back when you fire. So the safety turns on. That's a really cool, really safe feature. Like I've said it a million times, but this would be a great kid's gun. Forward. So quiet. So easy to reload. Gonna run out of, gonna run out of these. Gosh, what was that, eight or nine? Shoot. We'll check it after 10. I think this is 10. It's at about 500. Let's put a couple more since it's halfway, I'd say if we ran it all to the ground, that's like 20 shots, right? We'll shoot a couple more. I don't think there's any reason to go straight to zero, but that is so interesting to me. It's interesting because you want to know when you're out, like in a hunting situation, you know, right? If I was hunting with this and I had a thousand PSIs left, I knew I had 20 shots. And if I can't get what I'm hunting in 20 shots, I should not be hunting, right? <laughs> So freaking fun. check it out it's about 400 so that feels like more than five shots I've got just a couple left in my pocket here we'll run them out and then we'll go inside man it's so fast and easy to load What do you think, last one? All right. So I'll show you guys where it's at. It is still a little above zero. So it definitely has more shots in it. If this was a hunting or like a life or death situation, you definitely still get more shots out of it. That was awesome. I actually don't know how many I shot because as always I was having fun and kind of rapid firing. I just was really liking like how easy the controls are. Like even for a single shot, like that's pretty like, you can do that really, really fast. It's so easy. And literally I just love that to load it, you like check this out. So you just pull it up like that, right? And then when you put one of the rounds in it, you literally just put it down. It doesn't have to like click anywhere. You don't have to finick around with it. It's not sketchy. It's literally forward, back, safety off, boom. Quiet as anything. As always, I'm so pleasantly surprised every time I take some of these toys from Air Gun Depot out. They are just so fun. It never gets old. It's so like, it's literally relaxing. It's like a hobby. You walk out your door, be able to shoot some rounds, have fun, be super safe, and, you know, get some target practice. So I love this thing so much. I'm not afraid to say it's my fav probably my favorite. I've said it a couple times. But you know what? We still have time to put behind the Flash Pup and the Benjamin, and then I also really like the Full Auto. So um, we'll see if my favorite changes from time to time, which I'm sure it will. But that was really fun. If you guys have any questions about this here air gun, you can always check out Air Gun Depot for more information. And you can also comment below, ask me any questions you may have.